Down 2-1. Gone. Mike Mordecai off John Smiley. 3-0 Braves. Smiley surrendered four runs in seven innings. Tom Glavin would get some help defensively. Smiley at first. Darren Lewis, the liner. Fred McGriff. A double play. Glavin can do it on his own against his former teammate. Watch how he sets him up. One and two. Outside. Ooh, inside. Byron. Glavin, 8K, seven innings. Braves win it. By the final of four to one. Braves have won four in a row. Mark Lemke. His teammates call him the Lemmer. Three for five, extending his hitting streak to 14 games. The Astros completed business in Montreal. Top four, tied at one, bases loaded. Pedro Martinez loaded. facing Ricky two. Gutierrez. Here's a guy who throws Gutierrez 95 miles per hour. He throws a breaking ball. Gutierrez makes him pay. Bagwell, Maggot and score. Astros take a 3 1 lead. Next batter, Doug Grayback. Back on his best behavior. Doug loops one, and that because that bat sponsored by Coke comes up with a base hit. Brings in Rick Wilkins, the eventual game winner. The Astros led it four to one. They would hold on to win it by the final of five to three. Drabeck back from his five-game suspension. Houston went six and three on this nine-game road trip. Drabeck has won three in a row. It's the rookie Joe Vitiello in the first inning with two men on. This one's deep, and I don't think it's playable. Three-run homer from the rookie, the fourth of his career, and it's three to nothing Kansas City, just like that. Bottom five, five, three Royals. Here's Vitiello again off the end of the bat, opposite field. Watch Jim Edmonds go all the way up and just miss it. How close? I'd like to see this again. Ugh. Oh, Ugh. 7-3 Royals. Out of the glove and over. Top 7-7-4 seven, seven, Royals. Gary Gaetti against Mike Harkey. 34 homers for Gaetti. Smoking, drinking, goodness knows what else. As many homers as he had in the homer happy year of 87. 8-4. to four. Angels rally in the seventh. Chili Davis off Rick Heisman. Johnny Damon tries to get a trophy there, but his foot got caught. It's Davis's 19th home run. It's 8-6. Damon would start a rally in the eighth inning. The Royals would go up 10-6. Then in the bottom of the eighth, bases loaded for Chili Davis. Have a seat. Ring him up. Montgomery gets him, and the Royals hold on to win a barn burner 10-8. The Royals now have, counting Vitiello's two on Sunday, have 27 homers from rookies this year. The Halos now have 22 losses in the last 30 games. If they do cough this up, it'll be the biggest in the history of divisional play, bigger than the 79 Astros or the 78 Red Sox. Rangers also in the wild card, back of red hot Roger Pavlik and the behemothian Tony Clark have a seat. Phil Nevin, phone mom, and then Pavlik against Gomez. Ring the youngster up. Seven innings pitched, three hits, 12 Ks. Will Clark is the offense during the bun-sized smoke portion portion of the game against Jose Lima. Thank you, Ernie Harwell. McDaniel checking his sign with Jake Gibbs. A season-high 12 strikeouts for Pavlik on three days rest. The Tigers still have not won three straight series all season. To Comiskey. Tied at one, top six. Edgar Martinez up. Griff Jr. at second. Nobody outs. And he's running. And he's out. Ozzie gets his man. Later in the sixth, still tied at one. Bases loaded, two outs. Felix Fermin. And the White Sox get out unscathed. Tied at one after six. Bottom of the seventh. It's 1-1 when the rookie Lyle Mouton off Bob Wolcott. Fifth on the year. 2-1 White Sox after seven. Top nine, two outs. Rich Amaral at second. Roberto Hernandez, the whiff. And Vince Coleman to end of the game. Hernandez, save number 30. The White Sox win it by the final. Oh! 2-1. Since the All-Star game, Mouton is batting 353 with four homers, 21 RBIs. Rafael Palmero says hit it where? Here. one nothing Orioles. Brady comes in. Kevin Brown and Fuego. Mike Stanley. Tony Fernandez. Randy Velarde. 8K day for Brown on the day. Top nine, 2 nothing Orioles. Fernandez, the chopper to short. Cal makes the nice play. Fernandez trips over the bag. Sprained knee. He may miss a couple of games. And Fernandez goes the Yankees would load the bases in the ninth with one out. Jesse Orozco gets Paul O'Neill with a lot of women screaming to bounce in his 22nd double play of the year, which I believe ties him with Albert Bell for the West. And facing the likes of Alan Watson, Delano De Shields, with Raul Mondesi on board. Right down the line it goes, and Mondesi trots, trots home. It's one of the Dodgers. Then a little long ball. It's deep, and I don't think it's playable. Piazza, number 30. It's 4 nothing Dodgers. Top six, Eric Karras against Brian Barber. Shave this, son. Does the Carlton Fisk stuff. Fair ball. Home run. 8 nothing Dodgers. That was my Dick Stockton. Plenty of for Ismael Valdez. Ring up Jose Oliva. Ryan Jordan, ring him up too. Dodgers win 8 nothing. Rung him up.
Thank you. Then call him the streak. Valdez won five in a row, then lost four in a row, then won four in a row, then won three in a row, then lost four in a row, and then he won this game. So are the Dodgers one forfeit loss out of first? At Denver, Pat Rapp of the Marlins, bat in hand. He'd be the only one swinging it in this game. Marlins jump on Brian Ricard early and often. Top one, one on. Top two, top one, two on for Sheffield. He straightens it out. Vera scores. Tavares scores. Four nothing fish after the first. Things got worse. Reliever really Mark Thompson, Terry Pendleton. It's quiet at Coors Field. It's too quiet. Two run homer. Eight runs in the fifth. Pat Rapp, ring up Jason Bates. Bottom of the fourth, Bichette is up, fly ball to left field, and Kurt Abbott going out. I got, you got, we got. Ugh. That was the only hit the Rockies got. The Rockies are shut out. Mike Maddox had gone the first five. Sox leading 6-1 in the sixth. Alvaro Espinosa, Jeremy Burnitz, Billy Ripken, Jim Tomei. The lead is now cut to 6-5. Move to further action, top of the eighth, that's Lee Tinsley. Tied at six, one out, Mike McFarland, the grounded is short, Espinosa boots it. Terrible conditions there with the field, but there's no excuse for that toss. Off Tinsley, into the dugout, Tinsley scores, Sox go on to win it by the final of 96. Dennis Martinez, your starter, not your finisher, turned in his shortest outing since April of 93. Greenwell three for five with an RBI. He's batting right-handed against the rookie left-hander Roberto Rivera. Welcome to the big league, Senor Rivera. Eighth homer, right-handed this year for Caminiti. Padres 8-2 in the fifth inning, bottom of the seventh. Well, Turk Wendell is on, so here's Ken batting left-handed. You got it. Homers from each side of the plate on consecutive games. First guy in National League history to do it. Only the second guy in Major League history ever to do that. Fernando also homered. The Padres beat up the Cubs 11-3. Eddie Murray did it back in 87. That's it. Peter Gammons also says that Caminiti has signed a new two-year deal with the Pods. They say they have reached agreement on a contract with